Today's Toy Spot, we are having a look at the Playmates Toys Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutations Donatello. Donatello can transform from pet turtle to ninja turtle in a case of just opening up his shell and folding out some legs, bada bing, bada boom, you've got yourself a ninja turtle. Uh, it is recommended for ages four and up and comes with us from the folks over at Playmates Toys. We spin around the back of the package. Uh, we have mutated from ooze and raised in the ways of ninjutsu by their rat sensei Splinter. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles are ready to venture outside their sewer lair to fight evil everywhere. Shows you how to transform it from pet turtle, again, to say robot mode, but to turtle mode. And all four turtles are available in this set. Weirdly, though, is that the mutations line, I think, also refers to those turtles toys where you could put limbs on. And I still haven't warmed up to those at all, but you could put limbs and arms and stuff onto uh, areas and mix and match the, the turtles. But I think those were also called mutations, so I'm, I don't know why they would have called it the exact same name. I figure, if anything, it would kind of throw buyers and collectors out because they wouldn't really know, okay, this is mutations uh, transforming turtles. This is the mutations snapping together limbs. At any rate, Spot's going to take a break and get this open up. When we come back, we're getting a better look at Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Mutations, Donatello. There's more on your way, guys. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned. Spot figured he'd have a little bit of fun and have him in turtle mode first, and then just like the cartoon and comics, we would transform him into uh, the Ninja Turtle Donatello. Okay, so in mutation mode, most of it, I think, works pretty good. Um, I can see the route that they wanted to go to kind of make use of all the, the areas that they could use, like the, for example, Donnie's legs end up really end up being the front legs of the turtle when you get him in turtle mode. The I guess the thing that kind of bothers me though is the back section, these little back rubbery versions of, of legs they decide to use for turtle mode. It doesn't really even look like so much legs. It just it's a big rubbery kind of piece of plastic, and then you got the the feet on the end. I don't know if I would say it's very successful. As long as you kind of keep it from the front end, I think it looks good. You can see where his knee pads are. Yeah, I understand that. But, you know, if you look at it kind of like this, it looks pretty good. And mutations may not be everyone's cup of tea, but I, I loved the mutations when I was younger. Um, I used to have actually a couple of them. but So I, I, can, I can see that they were trying to give us advanced versions of the things that we used to grow up with. And the mutations back then weren't anything as complex as these guys. So I think like Playmates did a pretty good job. I think I would just say, don't look around to the back. This is, I think this is the weakest end of it right here. The one thing too, when you transform it, the sides of the shell also can, are rubber pieces that are inside the shell when you transform it. So these areas come out and they fill in all the little gaps. So yeah, pretty successful. Uh, articulation in turtle mode, Donnie has uh, just a swivel in the head. And the head's pretty good too. Little turtle pointed nose there. Uh, he does have articulation in the feet. But again, those will be the legs of the Ninja Turtle when we transform him. Yeah, I think as a whole, he's pretty good. Okay, so to transform him, we'll just bring the camera back a little bit. It's actually, it was more complicated than I really thought it was going to be. Uh, what you're going to want to do is take the shell and just detach it. And just kind of bring it to the back. But you want to take the tail. The tail is my, maybe the hardest part. Get the tail in there. Just like that. And then you bring the, shirt, the shell open. Uh, take the rubbery legs, the turtle, former turtle legs. And you're going to just swivel them in and tuck them inside the shell. They don't always stay because they're rubbery, but you just do your best to kind of get them tucked in there. Uh, then take the arms, the turtle arms of the Ninja Turtle and just bring them forward, just like that. Take this section, which is very reminiscent of like the old toys, pull it out like this, and then take it and spin it around and then slide it back down. 
And that's pretty much the turtle. Then take the little side flaps, what was his sh the sides of his shell, and just fold them in. And then while you're kind of holding everything together, snap the shell back together. Then flip it around. Hey, there's Donnie. Take the legs, straighten out the legs like that. Take the leg, straighten out the leg like that. And then just straighten out the arms. And there you have Mutations Donnie. Wait, what? Yes, he is missing his staff. His staff, I just didn't keep, I didn't have it with it because in turtle mode, he can't really hold the staff. Where would he keep it? So you can put the staff in his arm. And I gotta say, he's in, even in turtle mode, mutations aside, we just kind of forget about the mutation end of it. From a Ninja Turtle end of it, he looks pretty good. He's bigger, he's bulkier than say like the battle shell turtles or even for that matter the original basic turtles he is poseable he's got all the articulation that he needs he really is a complete looking tra uh, complete transformation yes he's a pretty complete looking turtle uh, face i think is good it's not it's one step up i think from the battle shell turtles i think he has a little more personality in this face and I think uh, the other turtles as well have a little more personality in their faces than just the outright basic expressions. But I think what I like so much about it is that they're they're beefy. They've got a good bit of weight and beef to them. Um, yeah, some of the turtle areas, you know, like the the legs from the turtle, you can kind of see on the side. Just pay no attention to that. And I guess you can, if I just bring the shell out a little bit there, Make sure that these, there we go. There we go. Make sure that that section, make these areas a little fuller. There we go. That's that's what we want. Yeah, I, I really like it. Uh, in the way of his articulation, Donnie, let's bring the camera back a little bit. Donnie's head is on a, uh, what looks to be a ball joint. I guess the heart, the one thing that bothers me the most is sometimes the shell doesn't want to stay in place. It doesn't always lock into place. Uh, arms are on a ball joint but they're not gonna ball joint out very far because it seems like the arms are really by nature close to the body anyways. Uh, arms are on, on a hinge, it rotates all the way around. It doesn't have any waist or wrist swivel. And his legs have a fair bit of articulation. There's a ball joint, but again, very close to the body that you can't move the legs out too far, but he does have that hinge and rotation in the, in the knee area and also that hinge in the foot. I think a pretty good win for Playmates. These turtles are, I would think, pretty decent. The weakest aspect of it is the rubbery legs that sit on the very back of the turtle when you transform him into turtle mode. But, you know what, I think once you get him in ninja turtle mode, I think it kind of, it excuses everything else because I, I guess they didn't want to, they could have probably made use of these arms in turtle mode but the honest truth, though, is then this would not have looked any bit like a turtle, like a regular pet shop turtle. So I, I think I think a pretty successful win by Playmates. Uh, Spot picked up the other four turtles, too, so we're going to be having a look at those guys separately. But as a whole, pretty happy with Transformations, or Mutations, Donnie. Uh, for that reason, I'm going to give Donatello here, I'm going to give him a 7.5. Today's Toy Spot, we're having a look at the Playmates Toys, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, Mutations, Donatello. Stay tuned, guys. Spot's going to have more videos heading your way. Thanks for watching, as you always do. I'll see you next time.